Here you go. Open up. Boop. Yum, 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 yum. <laughs> Hey guys, good morning. So I look a little crazy, but I just got done with working out. I also went to GameStop really quickly because I really wanted to get some things. So I'll show you guys what I got at GameStop when I go to back downstairs later on today. I'm making myself some more coffee because I'm actually going to get ready to film and I am so tired. I probably slept a few hours last night and that's it. I was so wired last night. Like I, my mind kept going and it wouldn't stop thinking about things. So I didn't really get any sleep and it's showing right now, <laughs> it's showing big time. So I'm having my second cup of coffee right now. I just drink my coffee black. I've always drink it black, which makes it really easy for keto. So then you don't have to worry about like any creamer or anything that you put in it. But I think that's the best thing. Like if you ever get into coffee, don't ever drink, start off coffee with creamer or anything. Otherwise you're never gonna be able to drink it black. And I think black is like probably the best way to drink it because then you don't have all those extra calories. But for me, I love the taste of black coffee. I think it's an acquired taste. You just kind of get it after a while, but I, that's the only way I could drink my coffee is that. Or if I go to Starbucks, I'll get like a skinny vanilla latte and that's like sugar free, but you would have to tell them like, I think you have to do something like you have to, instead of the milk, you have to get like whipping cream and like do this whole special order for it to make it keto friendly, but it's still like a little bit of calories. So black coffee, easiest way to go. You don't have to worry about anything. So I'm just gonna go ahead and set up my laptop, my laptop, my iPad, so I can watch YouTube videos while I do my makeup. I'll have this going as like a little quick, you know, time lapse of me doing my makeup, but this is what I do. I'm just gonna do a PR haul today. I'm not gonna be testing out anything new. My lashes are so wonky. I'm just going to do my makeup, do my PR haul, send that footage over, and then kind of relax and then go pick up Riley. So I'm just really, really tired. Really, really tired. You can just tell right now. I'm exhausted. So time to get ready. I'm tempted by the wake of love. Blinded by curves of wasted trust. Tell me if I'm giving enough. And I'll hold you close. because I'm just gonna relax while I'm filming. Um, hopefully it doesn't take me too long. It's about 11.45 right now, so hopefully I can get this done in like 40 minutes and then I'll have enough time to eat lunch and then go pick up Riley. But yeah, so guess what? Also wearing my ring again. I'm so happy. I'm happy that it fits. I told Joel and he was like, I was getting worried there for a while that I was gonna have to spend a lot of money to resize it. <laughs> I'm like, no, I would not have let you resize it because then that means I'm giving in to my fingers not shrinking back down and they did i'm very excited about it you guys time to film hopefully i can get enough energy i'm like drinking a ton of coffee because i need it i'm dying right now but i'm wearing the birthday suit color pop if you guys saw my color pop review of their new spring collection they sent over like this big pack of I got hair stuck on me. They sent over this big pack of blushes and birthday suit is actually like a already permanent blush. And I was loving the color yesterday and I've been dying to like use it. So I used it today and it is so pretty. I really like it. I also use that jelly, the light colored one. 
um, this guy right here and this is close to you i really like these jellies you guys go check out that video it's a really good collection from ColourPop. so i use that as like a base and i threw a little bit of like lighter shadows on top just keeping it light and fresh for today um but yeah so time to unbox some makeup and see what new collections are out so that way we can review them ASAP. So I put my hair up, but I just got done filming. So now I'm gonna make myself some lunch really quickly before Riley, before I have to go pick her up. Like before she gets home, I actually have to pick her up. So we're gonna balance that like that. Not the safest, but it will do. <laughs> um, so what do I wanna make? I don't know. You know what? Might as well. going to make myself some lean turkey with cheese and some salsa in it i just cook the turkey and then i have it for a few i need to actually like just cook two batches at once because i go through it so quickly you know i'm just gonna eat this whole bowl so it's just a lot of lean ground organic turkey and then i do a little bit of a seasoning in it i do it the mrs Miss, is it Mr. Dash or Mrs. Dash? but I do a little bit of that in it to add a little bit of flavor but it's also salt free which is good so that one I believe is keto friendly. I think so, let me check. This is keto friendly, so it's actually zero calories, zero carbs, zero almost everything. And I use the chicken one for it. I'm also gonna use some finely shredded mozzarella, which is low moisture part skim. Gonna use a little bit of this. Someone said that you can't eat dairy on keto. You can, you just have to make sure you're use, eating the right dairy. Can you eat like a ton of yogurt? No, I think there's certain yogurts you can eat though. I actually have one in there, but I haven't tested it out yet. But I'm just gonna put some of that in there. I'm gonna mix it into the beef so it all melts together. So it just looks like that. Or the beef, the turkey. Just put it for 38 seconds. I am so tired, you guys. As you can tell, I've got like no energy. And then in my PR haul, they sent over, one um, brand sent over a fragrance and it smelled really good at first. Like it had like a citrus smell and then it turned into a cannabis smell. Ollie, do you mind? So it first smelled really good and then the smell after it is what gave me a horrible headache. It just smelled like weed and it was not good. And this is my little bowl right here. This is all I'm really hungry for right now because my head hurts so bad. Ollie, stop, buddy. No more. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to eat really quickly. And then I'm going to go pick up Riley and then send over my footage. And then I'm just going to call it a day and give myself a break because I really didn't sleep very well last night. So we're just going to take it easy today. It's actually a really gloomy day. It's supposed to rain here really. Sh it's supposed to rain already, but it hasn't started raining yet. So it's just kind of like one of those days where it's kind of like just dragging on you know i feel like my equilibrium is also off right now okay so i'm just chilling in my room sending over <laughs> my this face is hilarious right here like deep in thought right there i'm gonna have to leave it running so i can go pick up riley because i have to go to target really quickly and get an anniversary card because tomorrow is my five year anniversary isn't that crazy five years you guys of being married it's insane it went by so quickly um so we are gonna go to la jolla this weekend and stay at my parents condo and just hang out there with riley for a night which will be really fun hopefully it's not raining um but yeah so i'm really excited about that and then we also find out ashley's um baby's gender my sister's baby gender this saturday morning which i'm gonna vlog as well i'm so excited so yeah so that's what's going on we actually just booked our hawaii vacation for i told joel i was like okay to justify this because i have never been to hawaii he's never been to hawaii i've been dying to go you guys i've been begging for years to go and I finally told him, you know what, we're doing it for, for our five year anniversary. So when I told him, I go, this is the way I'm justifying it. No presents for a five year anniversary, no presents for our birthdays. We are going during our birthday time. We're gonna go in the mid of May. Uh, my birthday is May 6th, his is May 10th. So I told him, I go, it's gonna be our birthday gifts and it's gonna be our five year anniversary gift because I wanna do it 
good, you know? We booked it yesterday, so I'm so excited. I cannot even begin to explain the ex I'm so tired right now, which is why it's not really showing on my face, but I am ecstatic. I have been dreaming to go to Hawaii so bad. I am so excited. We're gonna leave little Riley with my mom and my dad. Um, if we made the option to go and not choose like an adult only hotel for just in case if like if something comes up and my parents can't watch her then we're going to take her with us but um i think she'll be like seven months then so i think she'll be okay she's pretty easy going so i think we're gonna have her stay with my mom because if we brought her with us it'd really limit us because i really want to do like a helicopter tour i want to go horseback riding i want to go hiking and with her it would be kind of hard because of the heat i don't want to have her in that heat too long so there's that but i am so excited my head as you guys can tell is still really throbbing right now but um, I'm actually gonna go run to Target real quick and go get our anniversary card, but I'm gonna vlog that whole trip and I, it's gonna be, I don't know, that's like my dream trip right now. So I'm very, very excited. I worked very hard for it. So yeah, alrighty, I'm gonna go pick up the anniversary card and then go get my baby. All right, so we are trying butternut squash for the first time on March 20th. Let's see how this works for you. Yeah. You excited? Ready? Okay. <gasps> you don't look very excited. Open up. Open up. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Oh, it's yummy, huh? Yum. Yum, 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 yum. <gasps> Num, 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 num. Ready? Ready? <laughs> swallow. <laughs> swallow. Can you swallow? <gasps> yeah. Oh my goodness. Here we go again. Open up. There you go. <gasps> Ready for some more? Yeah? Ready for some more? Oh, you like it! Yeah, you like it! You're so ready for foods, aren't you? Yeah! <laughs> Yum! <gasps> Yay! Yay! <laughs> You're getting so big! Oh my goodness! Oh, you got all? You got it all? Oh! Yay! 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 Yum, 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 yum. Here you go. Open up. Boop! Yum, 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 yum. Oh my goodness, you're doing so good. You love it. Yeah! My goodness, you're eating this all up. You guys, she's eating a ton of it. You ready for some more? Here we go. Oh, you're so precious. <laughs> yeah. You like butternut squash. <gasps> yeah. Yeah, gotta let it go. Oh, we got it on your fingers. I think that's it. You guys, she's finished this, almost this whole thing of butternut squash right here. Can you believe that? I think she's full. You full? Yeah? You full or do you want this last little bit? Yeah, you're full. 
All right, so it's the end of the night. I just put Riley down right now. Joel's getting ready for bed. I'm gonna get ready for bed. We are exhausted. I'm actually gonna watch the challenge tonight. Comment down below if you guys act, if you watch the challenge. I love it. It's my favorite show. But um, yeah, so she really, really enjoyed the um, butternut squash. At some points, you're kind of like, mm, does she really like it? She made this face, but I think she was making that face because it was like a different texture. It was a different taste than what she's used to. So she's like, I don't know what this is. But, ah, oh, she was so cute and juicy. I took so many videos, you guys. So many videos. I want to make a cute little compilation for Facebook. And if you guys see it, share it and like it because she's so cute. And I'm so happy that the first time we gave her solids was such a good experience. So, she likes butternut squash. We're going to keep doing that one time a day for a week. And then we will do another one. I'm thinking we can try peas next. I think peas will be a good one. So... So excited that it worked out, so happy. Also, I forgot to show you guys what I got from GameStop. So I didn't even know that they came out with Diablo on the Switch. I love this on PlayStation, but I hate playing it on PlayStation because my thing is, you guys, is I actually hate playing a game system on a TV because my eyes aren't that great and I feel like the games, they don't make the text that great. And it's really hard to read some things and see little details from what like the TV. So I love playing on a handheld because I get a better visual. So it made me really excited they came out with this. Unfortunately, they didn't have any used copies. They only had new, but I'm excited to be able to play that again. I'll have to, I was hoping, I was like, if I already have this game on PlayStation, would I be able to have my same character? And she's like, no, unfortunately not. And I'm like, that would be awesome if I could transfer over so I didn't have to build up my person up you know but yeah anyways my main reason for going there was getting this guide for Pokemon I have both the games Pokemon Pikachu and Eevee and I was doing all my notes in a notebook and like on my phone and stuff <laughs> I'm a nerd you guys I love video games and I'm like a completist I like to make sure I get everything so I've started like my notes and everything checking mark like making sure I got all the Pokemon and then also I caught a shiny Zubat today. If you guys know Pokemon, you know what I'm talking about. It was green. It was crazy. Um, that came out of nowhere too. I don't know how I got it because I didn't even have a combo going for Zubat. So I don't know. It was cool though. So I got the book and I really, really like it. So I've been playing. I'm actually going to play tonight um, before I go to bed. I just kind of like told myself, I was like, I work so hard and I just need like a break every so often and do something that I love and I love playing video games. Kind of like de-stresses me and gives me something kind of fun to do because I just work constantly or I'm taking care of Riley constantly. So I figured I was like, you know what, in the afternoons when she's taking a nap and I have no more work, I gotta go to her real quick. Um, in the afternoons when she's taking a nap and I have no more work to do, I can play and that's what I did today. And then I'm gonna play tonight when she goes down for bed. So yeah, I gotta go get her though. So hope you guys enjoyed the vlog. Give it a thumbs up if you did and I will see you guys tomorrow.